What's up YouTube? We are starting this video now. Uh, this is going to be my overnight challenge video in this parking garage. And we're going to start this video now because I want to show you what it looks like during the daytime and while all these cars are still here. So we're just going to start this video and uh, just going to show you the second floor and then we're going to be parked up on the fourth floor for the night. Uh, that's where, where I'll be sleeping at. So just going to start this video now, I'll show you guys around real quick. It won't be too long for this clip but I'm on break right now so we will be walking around and going down this elevator because I'm not going to be going down the elevators during my overnight challenge guys. I don't want to be stuck in there overnight. Um, so I'm going to show you guys around real quick and then we'll go down the elevators. There's my truck guys. Look at this place. So worn out and creepy it is. Spider webs everywhere. There's everybody's cars. Here's the elevator. Look how, look how bad this place needs upcapped on. There's some beams too. I'll show you guys later tonight. There's some beams that um, have fallen down and they're currently being supported by like stilts that are holding up the walls. So yeah, I'm kind of scared to park here because I don't want my truck being crushed by a falling concrete block, you know? So uh, waiting on my elevator going down. And we always go to the stairs. So this is the elevator, guys. I'm not gonna show you guys inside the college uh, because I have to walk through it, but I'll show you outside. All right, I've crossed the street. There's the parking garage, guys. That's where we're staying at tonight. Another shots of downtown. Another garage. Across the street here. Yo, look at this dude's antenna. Whoa. Some more buildings downtown, guys. What's up guys, it is lunchtime and I'm actually going through Taco Bell. Now getting that grub on. Sorry my camera is blurry. I can there you go guys. A little less blurry there. Gonna get some grub and uh, gonna have my lunch. Then we'll get the overnight challenge started. Uh, later on tonight after I get off of work All right guys as you can see we're currently going up to the fourth floor here. We are we're on the third And we are sleeping up here tonight This is where I'll be sleeping in my truck up here Sorry for all that exhaust noise that you hear this is the fourth floor Camera's blurry again, but uh, I'll fix that during our vlog. But yeah, this is the fourth floor, guys. What's up, fam? We are getting this overnight challenge started right now. Um, I'm going to start by exploring the roof. That's where we're currently parked at. Uh, this is floor four, so we are on top of the parking garage right now. Um, in the middle of Youngstown guys there is all kinds of parking garages around here though so um, don't try, try to find this one because it's gonna be hard um, but anyway I'm not gonna give you the location of this guys I'm an employee for a company uh, nearby who we um, park here for free so our badges get us in um, to this parking garage so uh, don't come exploring here uh, this is private property and you can get arrested for trespassing so I do have access to be here anyway guys in my last video I was gonna show you my haircut um, honestly there's the change in my last video you could see how bad my hair was growing out and how just like pathetic it looked <laughs> so it was really long guys uh, I did change it up a little bit 
cut everything around. So it is a lot lighter, guys. Um, I did put the green in it. Um, it was blue at first, but it changed to green. So I did do all that just to you know make the channel look better, um, make me look better. <laughs> so I mean, so I hope you guys like the quick little change I did. I mean, it ain't much. It's just hair, but um, I did like my long hair in a way, but it's just hair, it'll grow back. I'm just glad I did some color with it this time. Anyway, I'm gonna walk around, show you guys the views of the city, and give you some inside looks at this parking garage. I just keep thinking that we have another overnighter. <laughs> but I guess they're staying over here for the night or they're at work for the night or they carpooled, I don't know. I heard a loud bang, but I don't think it was coming from this garage. I heard a really loud bang. Look at my shadow, it's so cool. I don't think it was coming from this garage. Guys, it's been raining a lot up here. It's been raining a lot. So there's the exit going out of here. If you guys do happen to see or spot anything that I don't catch, please let me know in the comments. I ain't expecting this place to be haunted, but if it is, my camera will catch it before I do. Or I will catch it before anything so it's either one of those two but anyway look at the city views i mean youngstown ain't much guys but this is a nice view for you know just being here look at the views Guys, there are so many bugs out right now attracted to all these lights. There are so many bugs. And there's pretty over there. My baby. Alright, so as you can see, it's one big loop. So we can honestly go over here. Guys, look how crazy this is, though. This is like the nice part of Youngstown. Um, so... This is actually Champion, and this is Federal. So this is the nice part of Youngstown. And then watch how crazy it is when you come over here. This is the almost like abandoned side of Youngstown. There's all kinds of abandoned places over here. And you know, it's like, and you're probably wondering why we aren't like there right now at one of those abandoned places. It's because I don't have access to those places, guys. I don't want to just break in, you know, and I don't want to be busted, but look, this is some kind of like old abandoned plant over here, way in the distance there, like before this building. Like, this is some kind of abandoned plant. That's definitely not being used. We got some construction over here. I forget what street this is, guys, so oh, it's over here. This is, I don't know, but anyway, and then this, all this is like almost abandoned buildings. There are so many abandoned, like, businesses in Youngstown, because nothing lasts here. Nobody can make money out, out here in Youngstown, guys, and that's just because we're like a poor city. I'm keeping a close eye on my truck because I left it unlocked with the windows down because that's where I'm sleeping at tonight and I really don't want it to be hot so okay guys this is there's a uh, good view of the Cavalli Center this is real big in Youngstown <coughs> this is where all the 
shows happen, the big time shows like all the concerts and um, wrestling, monster trucks and all kinds of big stuff happens here guys um, at the Cavelli Center. That's home of the Youngstown Phantoms hockey team. Oh shit, what did I just step on? Stepped on some kind of glass. I don't know what that was. So trashy. Such a trashy city. So all you do is find trash around here. And we're back each one of these uh, pillars, guys. As you can see, there's one way back there. Way over there, right by my truck. And that one. Those are all staircases. And each one of them are creepy. <laughs> they And they really stink. Like, somebody's been smoking, like, cigarette after cigarette in them. But anyway, guys, not much to see on the top floor. Other than that one other car. It's got really bad vibes over here. Really chilly. Like my body's tingling. Just in this dark corner. I don't know why. There's just really bad vibes. Because just the whole city's dark over here. There's not many buildings. Guys, I got really bad vibes right here in this corner. Did you see anything? I don't know. I'm going to just walk away. My camera got blurry for a second there too, I thought. I don't know. I don't know guys. I didn't like that corner. Just that one in specific. So they also have do not enter signs. This is the other way. So if you're coming out, this is where you come out of. From the bottom floors. And we come back around. Over there's a truck behind that part. Come back around. Right over there, guys, is the South Avenue Bridge. Actually go that way to go home, so... Yeah, there's the South Avenue Bridge. And I don't know what this building is, but it's definitely some kind of business or apartment building. Pretty cool. Oh, oh cool. And here's the UPS. Or USPS, I should say. Uh, Mills. Export center place. Whatever you want to call it. Just not really distribution. Well, they are distributing mail. I don't know. But, um, yeah. That is the USPS. P.S. building all those mail trucks down there so yeah this ain't uh this is the top floor guys <clears throat> not much to see what is this it's an old like oh uh, okay this is a sign like look how rotted out that shit is holy crap it is nasty Whoa, is this like a hole? Oh, I wonder what... That must be a drainage hole, because there's just, there's just no vent over there. Like, I could step in that and get hurt. There's another uh, stair tower, guys. I'm keeping a close eye on the windows. Make sure there's no one coming up. Anyway, guys... I don't want this video to be too, too long. I mean, it is just a parking garage, but we do have more to explore. So I'm gonna cut this uh, top floor off here, and I'm gonna go chill in the truck until it is 3 a.m. so we can go ahead and proceed with the night. Just wanted to show you guys how I'm currently sleeping for the night. This is my truck cab, single cab, bench seat. This is how I'm gonna sleep for the night, guys. I got a pillow here. I got some drinkage. I went to Taco Bell. I got some Taco Bell drinkage. I got some brisk iced tea in my bottle. And yeah, 
I got some music playing. I got my phone on a portable charger. I got my vapes, my e-cigs here. Chill and let the breeze come in. I got cherry and blue raspberry in one. And I just got straight up blue raspberry in the other. But they are awesome. This is how I'm chilling for the night, guys. Not bad at all. I have plenty of leg room, too. Thank God for full-size trucks, right? Okay, guys, we're just going to go ahead and start this adventure. I'm getting a little tired. Just want to get to sleep. I don't think this place is going to be haunted. Um, but we're... Oh, there's a train horn in the background. <laughs> uh, but we're going to go ahead and start this. It's 2.13 right now. So we're just going to go ahead and start this. Um, like I said, we're not going to take the elevators. We're going to be walking down the stairwells. So I'm going to give you a first-person view of that. Um, but we're gonna go ahead and get started. I did show you the this floor already the roof at the very top floor uh, So we're gonna walk all the way down to the basement and go up from there So guys like I showed you before this is like one of those pillars There's four of them and each pillar has a staircase and The one I parked next to is the only door that's open weirdly so uh, There's plastic bags everywhere nasty staircases I was telling you guys about I don't know what that is it looks like a speaker of some sort we're gonna go ahead and walk down see you guys no cameras no nothing just emptiness and disgustingness now if I hear any doors open or slam or anything I'm running back up because I don't want to be confronted by anybody guys this door's open a little bit door three let's see if this is open when I come back and sit here anybody on this floor anybody I don't see anything on that floor guys hear something here's two. Oh, look at that writing this is floor two Nobody's here. Nobody's on that floor. I really want to know what's behind here. Is that like an electrical panel? I don't want to press it. I don't want to press that button. Alright, so there's floor two. Here's floor one. Oh, there's somebody here. One of the college students are still parked. I hope the basement's clear. Holy shit. This really goes down. What is that door? Oh, that's the, okay. This is to get on onto the street. Something's running down here. This must be an electrical panel. Alright guys, this is the basement. I don't think anybody's here. Let's go check it out. Oh, this is where it's running.
So guys, okay, make sure I can get back in. The basement is actually a lot taller than the rest of the parking garage. This is incredible how deep the basement is. It's numbered differently too. Electrical room. So we're at B North on this corner. Okay, by two. So guys, this is the fourth floor. I cut this into one clip. Kind of scared to come down here alone. What? Oh, that's just concrete on a pallet. <laughs> I thought some. Okay. I thought somebody set up camp there. I don't know what these buildings are. That's weird. The basement's is cooler than I thought, guys. Look at this. There's a college inside there. You can see inside of the school. basement is really cool okay that's where the security guard was sitting before I came back in from Taco Bell I don't know whose car these two are but guys this is the rest of the basement right here I'm not gonna walk around I'm just gonna go back I'm gonna keep this video sweet and simple I want to know what's running oh guys there is a camera down here I think I don't know if that's a camera or not. I don't think that is. Okay, no. There's no cameras. Still. This makes it all the weirder. I think it's just a ventilation fan. All it is. Guys, this is a really cool basement though. Set up camp down here. All right, we're gonna head up to the first floor. Let me get. Let me show you guys the street level. All right, we're gonna go to the street real quick. Hopefully, there ain't no cops right here. <laughs> that would suck. All right, guys, this is the street level. Nobody really here. Go right back in. We're heading up to the first floor. How worn out everything is. Different vibes here, guys. A lot different vibes. Look how open everything is. Now, earlier in the video, I said things were beat like really bad here. This is what I'm talking about over here. We have supports holding up these walls. Look at this. Things are just breaking. That's creepy. So we still have parked cars here. I'm not really too worried that anybody's in them because they're always parked here. So, I mean, they could be doing something else. Anyway, look at this. Some creepy painting, guys. So, yeah, told you this place is always lit up. So we came through this door. I keep thinking my footsteps is somebody behind me, but it isn't. Okay, so we came through over here. You guys can see there's little windows. 
out here. I mean, this is the first floor, so it ain't really that tall. You get a good view of the street. There's a car coming. Taxi. Anyway, guys, there's the first floor. Not too much to see here. I mean, every floor is a little bit different, but I just want to show you how wrecked everything is and how destroyed and how, I don't know, how corroded cement can get over time. Leave that one open. That's how I left it. I'm keeping this video as unedited as possible too. So let me know if you guys see anything again. You guys can look straight up. All the way up to my truck. Here's the second floor. Guys, I usually park on this floor. So I say we explore more. There's all these little pipe tunnel things up above there. See that this go through? Guys, I don't think anybody's parked on this floor. This floor is free to roam. It's funny how this second floor is level with this three floor parking garage here so we are like right now level with their top floor and they have three floors so yeah these are nice views even from the second floor there's the roundabouts where you go up and down I say we, instead of taking the stairs, walk up one of those to go up to the third floor. That's what I'd like to do. Do not enter, I say we enter there. So we're gonna walk up one of those. Anyway guys, here's the rest of that floor. Again, as you can see right here, those are more beams holding up these beams. You know, uh, holding up all, these, all this concrete. So those, those are supports holding that up so they don't fall on other cars. Um, anyway, we're gonna walk up to the third floor here via the do not enter path. This is awesome, guys. I just love exploration and love being able to adventure no matter where it is. So, I'm going to be seeing this parking garage quite a lot, so therefore, we might as well know what's actually in it. Oh, I like how this, fuck, someone's here. somebody on that floor guys fuck it it's the same as the other ones right all right we're back up to the roof oh my god how did we get all the way over here I gotta walk this whole path to get to my truck Someone started up their truck in that garage. There was an engine, but I'm glad we got that basement footage. I just didn't want to get caught and lose my job or get thrown out or something. Just because I wasn't supposed to be here, even though I'm allowed to be here. Oh my God, that bird scared me. I probably scared him though more than he scared me. More birds, man. Oh my God, scared me again. God. Anyway, this is the top floor. Third floor really didn't matter. Same shit as the other two, the first and the second.
Oh, I guess I can just chill here. Make a cool chill spot. Sit right here. Enjoy the vapes. Guys, way over there, like I said earlier in the video, is the South Avenue Bridge. It's really cool lit up at night. No one's on it. Anyway, guys, I know this wasn't much of an adventure. I mean, it's just, I don't know. <laughs> it's just something to do. I mean, no matter what, though, uh, the point of everything is to just go out and live a little uh, I know most RG does say that a lot in his videos and I'm not trying to be a copycat but seriously take his words um, link will be down in the low if you guys don't know who most RG is go look him up just go out and live a little um, this is a live a little experience I honestly think Mo uh, he does live a lot I mean he does some pretty crazy stuff in his videos guys um, but this is just living a little bit guys going out and doing something for the night instead of staying at home um, filming um, a place where you know some great views are seen and it's just something to do go out instead of going camping or something like doing this in the middle of the city you know and just seeing some sights and walking around someplace you don't really know so again if you haven't subscribed to this channel please subscribe um, like this video if you haven't already this is some awesome content um, I'm providing for you guys. It would help a lot if you guys would just like the video and share it if you can. And just subscribe to the channel, allow notifications, whatever you can do. Um, just to help me as a YouTuber and help me grow. But guys, I, if you have watched this video to the end, I do appreciate you and I do want to provide you with more content in the future. So please stay tuned for that. I do have many more adventures planned for you guys. This is just one of many, um, but we're just chilling for the night here. I'm just on the fourth floor chilling and living on the edge, guys. That's all. Just living a little bit. I do wish we had that parking garage, though. I really do, because we're on that side of the road. I just, I hate crossing this street. That parking garage is so much more open and nice. I mean, I guess for this purpose, it does, you don't want it to be open because I'm trying to, you know, secretly record this and, you know, be up here alone by myself. But honestly, guys, that parking garage looks so much more nicer. And I would rather park there every day. But this one is a lot bigger and it has more parking spaces and more room. Um, anyway guys, I'm going to sum this video up, um, it won't be too much longer, and I will see you guys in the morning, I'll make a wake up clip just to prove that I stayed all overnight, I definitely want to stay overnight, like I ain't going to chicken out now, um, just because there wasn't anything here, so, um, yeah, I'm just going to stay overnight in my truck, and... I will see you guys in the morning. Hey guys, just wanted to make a quick little last update for the night. I'm in for the night, chilling in the truck. The lot is still currently empty. It is 3.05 in the morning. And yeah, I'm just chilling in my truck, enjoying my vape. And just chilling for the night, getting ready to fall asleep guys. Still set up with my pillow and my blanket here. And, uh, yeah, just getting ready to fall asleep. Hopefully the bugs don't come in because there's a light near. I'm actually going to go ahead and shut this back window. And, yeah, I got the, the windows cracked so I get a little bit of air. And yeah, I'm just going to fall asleep tonight to the city view. What's up, fam? That overnight challenge was a success. And I just woke up 8 in the morning. Guys, I am here in the truck. It did rain a little bit overnight. But I'm going to go home and edit this video for you guys. Get it uploaded to YouTube quicker for you. I hope you guys had a great time coming with me on this small little adventure. 
Please subscribe if you haven't already. Hit the like button down below and comment if you got any questions. Have a great rest of your day, guys.